This is code.org. I'm currently working on their CS Fundamentals class. I'm on course D, lesson 7, Drawing with Shapes and Loops, part 9. Look for the pattern and make the code shorter using a loop. And remember, a loop is what repeats code. So right now we have 18 blocks in our workspace, but they would like us to only have 7. So let me hit run and see what happens. Oh, oh wow. So we're drawing stairs before with this cool pattern, but we need less code. So I'm going to look for repeat code. Move forward by 50 pixels. Turn right. Okay. Move forward by 50 pixels. Okay. Turn left. Okay. So this doesn't repeat yet because we have a turn right, turn left. Let's see. Move forward by 50 pixels. Turn right. Wait a minute. That matches this. Forward, turn right. Is it 99? Yep. And then after that at the top, we move forward and then we turn left. What do we do here? Oh, look, we move forward and turn left. Okay, forward, right, forward, left. Ah, that's what's going to repeat. So there's an easier way to make all this code repeat. We can use our repeat loop. And I'm going to put it here. Any code inside of this, so I'm going to drag all this and drop it there. Any code inside of this will now run, well, four times. Instead of writing all this code, let's get rid of it. Let's see if our repeat with a four works. And remember, it's going to loop through each line. So it goes forward, turns, forward, left, hits the bottom, zoop, back to the top. Forward, turn, forward, turn, zoop, four times. After it runs four times, if we had something below it, that code would run too. Let's test. Oh, great, we got it. Let's keep going.